Hey guys, thanks for tuning in once again. Today I'm going to create this beautiful tropical beachy uh, look with one palette and the palette in question is Afriki by Juvia's. Honestly guys, if this palette is not love, I don't know what is because honestly crazy colors it has. So honestly, I bought this palette specifically for one, two, three and four, four colors and therefore I have used these two today. Probably I'll create uh, one or two more looks with this palette because uh, recently on my Instagram I had showed off these palettes that I have recently purchased. A few of you were asking me to create some looks with this palette because uh, if you look at the colors they are beautiful but they are not very as in cohesive if you if I may say it doesn't have uh, any dark colors or there's no black or dark brown that you can you know kind of smoke all the looks out so i thought that's a good idea let me uh, let me just continue my series of one palette look and uh, this will probably help you guys understand how to create beautiful vibrant looks with one palette even when there are no blacks or very dark matte browns in the palette yeah i i don't know if i'm making any sense but uh, that was the whole agenda behind this um video so if you are interested and want to know how i created this beautiful tropical look then stay here and keep on watching <laughs> Hi guys, so I'm taking my Afriki by Juvia's palette and I'm taking the shade Aya and can you see how pigmented it is? Dang. Anyway, so I'm placing it all over my crease. As you can see, I'm not uh, quite blending it yet, but I am just placing the product and in the dabbing motions and uh, yeah, and then blending it off. Next up, I'm taking the shade Niger and crazy pigmented it is. And I'm placing it just beneath my crease or maybe just up, uh, on my crease and again, placing the color and taking a separate clean blending brush and then blending it. Taking my time there because honestly, this is the most important step guys. So next up, I'm taking that beautiful uh, sparkly navy blue shade, Colo Nu. I don't know how to pronounce it, so I'm sorry if I'm pronouncing it wrong. And I'm placing it all over my lid. Not all over, maybe uh, halfway through my lid. Uh, as you can see, I'm patting the color and packing a punch there. And then I'm taking the shade Togo and placing on the latter half of my lid so that there is a beautiful transition happening from blue to uh, forest green if that makes any sense and then i'm taking a shader brush from color bar and placing that beautiful shade niger on my lower lash and ta-da i am all ready to rock and roll so guys this is my final look i know it looks like crazy colors but honestly they are not you can just wear a plain simple black t-shirt you can wear a yellow t-shirt or a blue t-shirt and you are good to go with this so that is it for my video i hope you had fun watching this video because i honestly had a blast filming it for you guys so if you like my video then please give this video a big fat thumbs up and also hit the subscription button down below and ring that notification bell as well so you guys don't miss out on any uploads from mine and guys until next time thanks for watching